Right, right guys, I'm here with Thomas Peters. Thank you for your time. No nice problem. to meet you. Uh, we're going to talk driver. We're going to look at Thomas's Callaway driver. We're going to quiz him a bit about if he knows what's actually under this head, co uh, this head cover. Let's get stuck in. Right, Thomas, driver. You're known as long ball. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what's your driving average? Do you know your distance? Um, what are you a, carrying this off to? What am I carrying to about 270 meters? Oh, he's doing it all with his meters. That's in yards, so that is like 300 yards. For all you British people. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely, about 300 yards. So you know your distance, which yeah. is obviously important when you get out there and play. Mm -hmm. You've got a Callaway Great Big Burfa, which lots of people, this is, you know, lots of people will sell this in shops as the game improvement model. Oh, really? You know, because you've got the double black diamond, which is like the low spinning, better player one, but you've opted for. Uh, a different head, which is, I think is an interesting one for the guys and girls at home. Um, do you know how it's set up? That's always a question I ask tour pros. I think I always interested in the art. Do you know how it's set up? Loft, shaft, you know, how much do you know about this club? It is set up um, to go straight for me. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So you're well, I guess it, it, it says fade here, so it's set up for a slight fade, I guess. Well, it's not because no? that okay. weight, the more you put it in line with the middle, actually the more kind of neutral bias oh, it would right, be so right. it, they put that again that's more of like a selling tool than it is um so that's more for the shop floor than it okay. is a factual thing so i think it's an interesting um story here do you know the loft obviously it's got it written on but do you know if the neck is setting it up to that yeah you have to look it's 9.0 <laughs> yeah loft. it's nine zero and it is neutral standard so it okay. actually is set up yeah. as that so you're one of those guys who will go to the tour truck get on maybe a machine hit them let them trust to get you kind of the right feel or exactly. uh, the right numbers. You're not perving over it yourself. So. Exactly. If I if I try a new driver, I'll know after about three shots if it's a good if it's for me or not. And you're basing that on feel. Feel. Look. Uh, yeah. Feel. The the look is very very important of the club. Okay. And your ball flight. Yeah. So you're looking at the flight. Yeah. Look at you're feeling it and you're looking at it down by the Exactly. Way. I think that's a really interesting. One. I test clubs as part of my job. I, mm -hmm. I do uh, club reviews. Yeah. Um, and I do a numbers part. Hit the club and show people the numbers. Yeah. And people can get so fixated on those numbers and they forget to buy on looks yeah. and feel. Where if you speak to many good players uh, like Thomas here, that that's often the way you guys are actually doing. Things, yeah, for sure. Because I mean, when you're playing, I guess feel is such a big part of what you're doing. Mm -hmm. isn't it? Just, uh, it's a field game, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. All day long. There you go, guys. Just a quick little video. I think it's an interesting message because when I picked this up with Thomas, I asked him about it and he didn't know. So I recorded this video just to show you maybe just to chill out a bit. Yeah, a bit chill chill out, out, man. Right, just Thomas. And just boom it. 300 yards. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for loads more videos. Find me on Instagram at CrossfieldMark. Also on Twitter at 4GolfOnline. Find me on Facebook, Mark Crossfield. Thanks for watching, post comments as always, and see you soon.